Hello fellow survivors, this is your buddy RB Guy, back again with another little quick video review. And my last video guys, I did a quick review on the um, HK VP9, uh, Europe's answer to our 9mm handgun, okay? You guys want, might want to check that out, but today we're going to do something a little bit different. We're going to do a video on the Ruger. The Ruger 380 Max. Now, let me open up the box. The Ruger 380 Max, guys, is a smaller handgun. Okay? Small personal carry handgun. It holds about 10 bullets in the clip here and one in the chamber. All right? Now, inside this box, it, it comes with its own carrying, little carrying holster. All right? the gun goes in um i'm sure you can buy other ones online but that's the holster for it and it also comes with the same locking mechanism um the bullets are different for the 380 standard nine millimeter bullets that you'd put in the ruger i'm um, not the ruger i'm sorry that you put in your vp9 or your or your glock 9 they're abundant and easy to come by but the Ruger has their own 380 ammo, smaller bullets in size. And um, from what I understand, they're a little bit harder to come by. So if you guys are looking to get a small concealed carry weapon like this, um, whenever you can get a chance, stock up on the bullets. That's my advice. But if we hold this one and we leave it right here, okay, leave it right here, in comparison to the size, you'll see the difference. Okay, these are the different in the gun. Now, why would one somebody want a smaller gun? Well, if they conceal carry, they don't want to be as noticed. Um, this works. This gives a lot more kick than a twenty-two. It's more powerful. Um, maybe for a second, a second hand gun, something you can put down. Uh, if you've seen, ever seen the movies of cops, cops, or they have one in their ankle, ankle gun or boot gun, maybe something like that. Um. But what I'm thinking is that this gun right here would be something for the ladies. Something that a woman could put down in her purse. Um, something that she could put in her waist and pull her shirt over. Something small that could save her life. Something for like your mother, your daughter, your wife, um, your aunt. Any female that would like a small concealed firearm. This would be perfect for, okay? Now, the Ruger does not have a safety, guys. It has a trigger mechanism, something slim, similar to the, um, the VP9. And if you could look right here, there it is. Now, if you try to pull it back, it won't, it won't, the trigger won't go back unless you hit that little piece right there, then the trigger goes all the way back. So it doesn't have a safety, a regular safety, but then again, it kind of does. All right, on this side of the gun, you have your little button to release your magazine right here. All right, and like I said, you can put 10 in the mag and one in the clip. So it gives you 11 shots. Um, like I said, I think this is a nice little gun for conceal and carry. It's not noticeable. You don't have to worry about hiding it too much because it's so small and you get more power than a 22 um and from a survival standpoint let's say you have yours you have your carry gun and you know you leave your wife alone all day you work on long trips or on the road or anything like that at least you know she has something to protect and save herself same thing with your mother your daughter your aunt your sister i think this is a perfect gun for them for me I need something a little bit larger, but that's personal preference. Again, the price on this gun is not very expensive. A couple of hundred bucks and you can get this gun. It's not very expensive. Like I said, it's small, it's sleek. Um, it comes in another color with a silver top also. But I think this is an excellent little gun for carrying protection. And you guys should look into it. The Ruger. 380 max
Check it out. Something for the ladies when the shit hits the fan. Until next time, peace.